Okay, that works. Is that a boss? No. Alright, we're back in MM, baby. Let's go. I haven't played MM for ages. I've just been playing uh, bloody loads of uh, BM and survival. This is a lot of trash. <laughs> this is this is a lot. DBM and big leagues are completely different styles. I like the way that DBM works, but I've always used DBM, so I don't know. I can't I can't compare. Yeah, I can't make an assessment really. But I always liked how DBM kind of looks like it's built into the game. If you know what I mean, like it always looks really nice. At least in my opinion, anyway. It's a bit shouty. <laughs> Yeah, maybe that's good for me because I'm terrible. Yeah, maybe that's a good thing. So is there a boss here? Oh, there is. TBM is a lot better with the voice packs give the actual callouts rather than honks and klaxons. Yeah, that shit annoys me. Come to you? What is this? Oh. Hello. Raise your eyes <laughs> and behold the oh, there's the boss. Can I kill the boss? Oh, it's only got like a little bit. It's only got 60% health. Oh, they've pulled. All right, I'm officially whatever this is. Is this actually a part of the boss? I don't think I'm actually doing anything. Oh, it's just to clear trash. Okay. I mean, it's something different, isn't it? Alright, so there's a boss right here. Why? It's already on 60% health. Oh. What is this? That's a lot of nature damage. Alright, I assume we move out of that. Oh, okay. Oh god. Uh, what do we do? Oh, what do we... No, no, no! Ah. My spawn must feed! Oh no. Oh, the boss is defeated in the dungeon but not killed. Ah, oh, okay, got it. Well, I'm dead. I'm back. And I ran straight into something. Alright, I can't actually attack. There we go. So was I the only one that- oh no, it's like two people died. Okay, so now what happens here? So do I need to be on the other side of that? Oh, I see, okay. Just rolls you away. We can get like 800k crits. Oh crap. Okay, I mean the boss seems fine, I guess. I'm assuming it's gonna move again. Oh, what's this? Oh, am I gonna get webbed? Yeah. Oh no, I didn't get webbed. <laughs> I thought it was like gonna do something. 
All oh, right, I'm guessing you got to take those off to the side and probably not do them in the middle of the room. That makes a lot more sense, actually, thinking about it. Wow, my DPS is even worse in MM. Alright, where's that? I mean, mm, what do you what do you guys think of the boss? Yeah, what do you guys think? Any good? Seems okay. I'm sure in the other difficulties it's a little bit more fun. Yeah, I'm just gonna run through this to try to get over here. Oh, hello, ads. The model looks really good. Yeah, it does. Yeah. It's like a cursed moth. So there's that ability there. So you drag it off to the side and then you run away from it. I mean... It's the mount that drops from here? Is it? I thought the mount was like a... Uh, it was something else. No, uh, that's not the mount, yeah. So, okay, so I'm gonna go... Oh no, not again. I oh, know, we're fine. Like the last boss? Yeah, I've seen the mount. Yeah, it's like a, um, what do they call it? I can't remember what they're called. Like the boss in, um, in, uh, Naxxramas. I can't remember what the boss is called. Yeah, there's two. There's a mythic one and a normal one. Really? The boss is going to do all this at 10%? Kel'Thuzad? No, not Kel'Thuzad. <laughs> In the spider wing. The first boss. Level the mounts. We're seeing a wolf in. There are some cool ones, yeah. Abnu... Yes, that's it, yeah. Alright, for science, I'm going to stand in this too. Alright, it doesn't actually do anything. Apart from a little bit of a slow. Yes, Abnu... something or other, yeah, that's right. Well... That was certainly a boss. Very fun. All right. Uh, does normal raid also open or just LFR? It's just LFR today. Yeah. Uh, so that was uh, all right, I guess. <laughs> uh, let me just move over to Beast Mastery. Let me send a text quick. Okay. I got a warbound drop. Oh, really? Was it personal loot? Oh, crap. Oh, I'm in Beast Mastery. Oh, nice. That's cool. Good little catch up. Yeah, it looks like one of these, the boss. Uh, the mount, sorry. It's, uh... This thing. Yeah, so that's that one. And then there's a mythic one. Looks pretty good. Oh, you got this. Oh, you got a warbound neck. Veteran gear. Very nice. I've not been this excited as I am now to play new expansion. Oh, yeah? Oh, that's good. There is no need for us to entertain this filth any longer. Right, what is the next boss? Oh, it's uh, Cahoon. 
Gahoon 2, Electric Boogaloo. Uh, see, here's the thing. I've changed to Beast Mastery, but here's the thing. The problem is, it's not the spec. <laughs> it appears to be a player issue. Class reworks? Where are you going to get those next week? What's this do? Glyph of the Dread. Decipher the Glyph. Need Kazalgar Inscription. Oh. It is absolutely a skill issue, yeah. Uh, hero specs on next week. All right, yeah, that's true. Anyone got a clue when season four actually ends? Uh, well, it properly ends when the expansion launches on the twenty sixth. Died. Well, at least you can mount here. Oh my goodness. <laughs> oh my goodness, you can mount. What a day. Well, that's good. I mean, the, the the raid is massive. Um, but yeah, the season kind of ends next week, but then it doesn't really end. It's only really like the a hundred percent, no, the uh, one percent stuff, and that's about it. All right, so now we're in the next bit. So how many bosses are in the swing? Three. All oh, right, and then the the last wing is the Silken Court and Queen Anserac. Please turn on Arachnophobia mode. Uh, there's no crabs. Yeah, nothing's turned into a crab. No, I'm not seeing any crabs. Unless it didn't work. Oh, there's a crab. On the wall. Bugs aren't spiders. Yeah, they're just bugs. They're not they're not spiders. There's some crabs on the wall though. But they bugging me. Wow, this trash is awful. There's just so much of it. And there's so much health. Are the crabs wearing hats? I don't think so. Crabs are armored battle spiders. What genius thought it would be nicer to look at? <laughs> battle spiders? <laughs> oh dear. They should have like a low graphics mode for WoW, like similar to the arachnophobia mode. You press it and your graphics just go to like really crappy. Can you tame these bugs? Uh, I don't think so. Alright, let's turn arachnophobia mode off. Oh, wait, there's still crabs? Uh, Blizzard? <laughs> Pixel mode, yeah. I loved it in, uh, what was it, the uh, Diablo 2 remaster. They had that, where you could like switch to the old uh, the old spec. Does the hero, uh, the, the, the Dark Ranger hero still not work? Uh, I don't know, I've not really done it. Just bring the render scale down? Oh, I guess that's true. Does the, no, it, I don't think it affects the last boss. So it's still crap, oh no, they're not crabs now. All right, Cahoon. What's the crack here then? Uh, experimental dosage uh, causes nearby eggs to hatch, unleashing a horrific experiment. Uh, unstable web immobilizes nearby players, and blood parasite infests the target. Okay. Uh, blood twister injects players with experimental dosage, which causes nearby eggs to hatch upon expiration. 
upon reaching 100 energy, will ingest the black blood, causing the room to slowly fill with sanguine overflow. All right, that sounds like some sort of hideous thing. Yeah, pack, uh, pack leader is kind of boring, yeah. The room has... The room has three seconds, uh, depending on where you pull the boss above. Uh, oh, three sections, right. Okay. Yeah, the final boss room's up there, I think, isn't it? Uh, oh, maybe not. No, it's here. Or is that... Well, I think that is that area. Fancy. Right, let's go. Oh, there's two platforms. Awesome. Oh, it's the same as this boss. <laughs> Just tons of platforms and several floors. That sounds fun. All right, I'm just gonna chill back here and hope for the best. Is War Within good so far? It seems okay. Uh, I'm not that jazzed about Special being underground, coming. but I think the content itself is fine. Holy moly, my game just nearly melted. All right. Well, the boss is on 80% already. So that's good. Thanks, I'll let my friends of Blizz know. Wait, what? <laughs> Any plans Target you. Uh, to world first guest host this coming tier, or is that a secret? Um, don't know. Maybe, maybe Interrupt. not. No creeping black blood on LFR. Oh god. I mean... <clears throat> I don't know, man. We'll see. Yeah, we'll see. FPS is negative. I, I mean, I had a little, little jolt at the beginning, but it seems fine now. So what is actually going on with this boss? I'm just attacking it, and it seems to be going down. I don't appear to anything else to be going on. Oh, there is blood. It's just giga slow. Oh, that? Yeah. I'm guessing that's like an enraged timer of sorts, right? Clear the eggs with the purple ring. Oh, okay. Well, I'll let you know when I get it. The boss might die before that, though. Ross flows splat on people, use splat to crush eggs. Okay. Target you. Oh, is this my moment? Oh, there's the purple ring. Oh, it's taking a lot of damage. I think we're fine. Black blood fills room from the tap. If it reaches the eggs, it empowers them. Oh, okay, interesting. So we need to kill those eggs over there, basically. Otherwise, we're gonna be in a bit of a, a bit of a situation. Oh, doesn't matter anyway. The boss is dead. <laughs> What's this? Kazalgar cooking. So what is this? A dawn armor devoted insignia to things inside the palace. We smuggled severed threads. Oh, okay, so it's like a rep thing. Cool. Yeah, that was. Uh, I mean, I'm sure the mechanics well are fun on other modes. Right, Nexus if Princess. So is that uh, Stabby? But Stab Stubs. Oh yeah, that is sick. That is awesome. The tiny boys are the 
Cahoon affix from BFA Mythic Plus to spiders or tank busters and midi boys do something. <laughs> the visuals are hella cool. Oh, brilliant. I'm looking forward to it. I mean, it, it's a cool raid. I'll give it that. It's my first time in here, so... Certainly, uh... Certainly a good time. This entire raid gives me a Shara's Palace, but upside down. It's a little bit like that, yeah. Yeah, I believe it can drop that fist time, yeah. Oh, did we make the bees on the last boss? I wasn't even looking. I'm assuming not. Yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and say we didn't even make top 10. I wasn't even paying attention. I was trying to not die, which is just my usual kind of gameplay. Reed does give a Shara Palace uh, Abarus. It's a little bit like, yeah, the color scheme is definitely a little bit Abarus for sure. It's massive though. Yeah, it's a big raid. But at least you can mount in some of it. This, These models are so cool. Yeah, these models are so cool. They're so different. I don't know what they're even based off. We're long overdue an outside raid. Yeah, I guess. I always liked, um, what was it called? Desire Law. I thought that was a cool raid. <laughs> Did someone hero on the trash? <laughs> so these things drop the, uh, the currency, right? The old cage or whatever it is? I don't know, I guess not. Hydra, yeah. Hydra was cool as fuck. I always loved Hydra just because it's like a massive Warcraft 3 reference. Like the whole thing. Like all the NPCs, the buildings, the layout, everything is like a... It is literally like playing Warcraft 3 in WoW. Like it's like, you know, exactly the same. Even the sounds and stuff of like the NPCs and, and all that is all the same. And I absolutely adore that. I think that's such a cool thing that they did. I wish they did more of that. Like, they even had the peons and the and all that kind of jazz. So sick. Had so many bangers. Oh, Desire Law was probably the most underrated raid of all time. It is cool, yeah. It is cool. Yeah, Jaina was a, a, a cool fight. Right. What's this one? I'm assuming this is some sort of shenanigans with professions. She suspects nothing. Oh. Alright, someone already picked it up. Oh, there we go. It's a bus. You have seen too much, and I cannot leave any loose ends. Dude, yes. Look at these animations. Nothing she's talking to Riddicron? Just business. Hydra is a low-key raid. Wow, lovers don't talk about enough. It's kind of shit to solo, to be fair. Would say the music in BOD was great, um, but that goes for all of BFA. BFA music went so hard. Yeah. Broker boss. Yeah, a little bit, yeah. What's the, the crack here, then? Oh, TLDR, this boss. Plant portals Five, that want to suck you off. Three, Stand between the portals two, so you get sucked one. off from multiple directions rather than one direction. Alright, cool. Is that in the dungeon journal? All right, there's some portals. Watch your step. Oh. Okay. Look. Okay. Right. Oh god. No, don't do it. I don't want to join. Heard that there'll be a spec-specific casting animation. Is that true? Will Holy Priest have different animations to Shadow Priest? Stay away from lines. All right, we're staying away from the lines. Um, Watch your step. I, not that I'm aware of, but maybe. Auto mods checking my message. All right, I see. So I'm just getting dragged around. So is there a, a rhyme or reason where to position these things, or are you just kind of? Kind of doing it. This boss has some very, very cool Stay animations. Away from lines. You my 
What's this is skin? a really cool raid. Uh, raid boss. Auto mod? Yeah, I don't think any mods are here to allow that message. Stand between two portals where you stand still if you have two portals to your right. To, oh, you're going right? Oh, okay. Nice. What's this? Oh, God. Wait, get away from me. Matt Maggle? Thanks for following, man. Mod me real quick. I'll take care of it. Uh, no, you're okay. What? What? What is going on? You don't have to move at all with the pulls. Well, wouldn't you have to move if you have two on one side? Where's chocolate? <laughs> uh, probably with his family. I don't know. Watch your step. Okay, so if I stand here, we should be fine, right? Yep, totally fine. Oh, there you go. Just drags me into this little corner. Oh, then you have to avoid this because this is going to hurt. Right, okay. Stay away from lines. Did I get hit by the line? I think I did. Watch your step. Oh, it's another one. So, no, this is not. Okay, no, this is. I need to move. This is harder on LFR than HC. <laughs> you think? I like this boss. I don't know what it's like on the other difficulties, but this seems fine. Stay away from lines. Yeah, this seems okay. Alright, so get away from that. What happens if you go into the portal then? Is it. Is it night night time? Uh, basically, normal rows, just more of those. Okay, so this is a mechanic I don't understand. So, what the hell's happening here? Everyone gets these weird beams. I guess you just avoid them. Alright, I have one. Don't overlap them. Oh, okay. I mean, it doesn't seem to do much. It's quite literally for Ak, yeah. Alright, I'm going to stand over here by myself. I can't believe we actually got a queue for LFR on both wings. What a day. What a day. And it gives me something to upload on the second YouTube channel, which is exciting. Run out. I haven't done anything on there for ages. Right, what's this? Oh, I'm the portal person! Doesn't matter. It died. Look at that! But did you believe you were fighting the real thing? I will leave the queen to you. I get paid regardless. I will let your bounties grow before I collect. Oh, they actually. All oh, right, they're Until gone. Then, watch your back. Oh, they're so. Could you imagine when they're coming back, chat? Yeah, I wonder when they're coming back. Maybe in that, uh, ethereal raid. Alright, that's it. Can we go into this area, or I guess it's blocked off? Exposing the ethereal as the queen on Bayes, you need level up to 8 years, a way to make an instant AE. So if you go on the, it goes to 11 realm, it will give you a, uh, a level 8. Yo, thank you, chat. If anyone did join that group, I very much appreciate it. That was a lot of fun. I'm glad we got that done today. Oh, no, we can't go any further. All right. Seem good?